Namaste everyone and welcome back to my channel. In this video, I'll be talking about and demonstrating Pada Dirasan, which is the breath balancing pose. Our breath is a manifestation of pran or the flow of the vital force through our body. The energy passing through the right nostril is said to flow through the solar energy channel, Pingala Nadi, while the energy passing through the left nostril is said to flow through Ida Nadi or the lunar energy channel. To know more about Ida and Pingala, please have a look at another video that I have on my channel, which is about the alternate nostril breathing. Now, the way we breathe or our breathing pattern has a direct effect on how pran flows through the body. And with Pada Dirasan, we are able to bring about a balance in the flow of energy through both of these energy channels. And that brings about a balance in many other pairs of opposites, such as the left and the right brain hemispheres, the male and the female energies within us, the sun and the moon, the lunar and solar energies, the emotional and um, analytical nature within us, the um, active and receptive side of us, and the more rational and intuitive side of us. And through this balance, we're able to reach a more subtle realm and we're able to get into a state of pure potential. All right? So we're going to practice this together or you can just watch and practice it later. However, please keep in mind the contraindications for this pose. If you have hernia or any ailments in the intestines, such as ulcers in the intestines, this should not be practiced. And if you're pregnant or have any other medical conditions or any pain in the body, knee pain or spinal injuries, please do not practice this uh, posture or any other pranayam um, technique without consulting your doctor first. All right, so we're going to begin in Vajrasana, so the kneeling position. Knees are together, toes are together, and I'm creating a long and tall spine keeping my neck in alignment with the spine. Now I'm going to bring both the hands underneath the opposite armpits and fold the arms over. So this space between my thumb and the index finger is pressing onto my armpits. My shoulders are relaxed and I'm going to just close my eyes and stay present with my breath here, taking in deep and relaxed breaths. And then when I'm done, I'm going to slowly release. Now, it is important that you feel a little bit of pressure underneath the armpits. If this is not giving you enough pressure, another way to do this is to make fists and place the fists under the armpits. You can start off with five to 10 minutes if you're a beginner. And then as you advance in your practice, you can go up to 15 to 20 minutes. If you have one nostril that is blocked or partially blocked, if let's say the left nostril is partially blocked, you're going to place the left hand underneath the opposite armpit and take a few breaths here. You might even feel a difference in just a matter of seconds. So depending on how it's working for, for you, just be present, do it for a few minutes and see how it works and how it releases that flow of energy and balances the flow of energy through both the channels. I hope that you found this useful. Do try it out. Leave me a comment below so that I know if you've practiced it. And please do like and share the video so that it can reach more people and subscribe to my channel so that you get to see more of such videos. Thank you very much for following. See you next time. Namaste.